Welcome back to Hit Stick Football, where we break down the real story behind every NFL team's moves. Did you know that only 54% of last season's Titans starters are returning this year? That's right, the Titans have overhauled their roster like no other team in the league. Today, we're diving deep into the Titans' aggressive offseason strategy that's turning heads across the NFL. Will these bold moves be the answer to their playoff dreams, or will they fall short? Smash that like button, subscribe, and let's dive in. The Titans weren't playing it safe this offseason. Tony Pollard signed on a three-year, $24 million deal, aiming to add versatility and explosiveness to the offense. Calvin Ridley and Tyler Boyd were brought in to strengthen the receiving cores, providing Will Levis with reliable targets. The Titans invested in the draft heavily with J.C. Latham, a first-round pick who will anchor the left tackle position, Tavondra Sweat, drafted in the second round to bolster the defensive line. They traded a 2024 seventh round pick and a 2025 third round pick to the Chiefs in exchange for Lajarius Sneed and a lower 2024 seventh round pick, aiming to solidify the secondary with proven talent. But when you revamp a roster, some big names have to go, and the Titans are no exception. The Titans lost star running back Derrick Henry to the Ravens on a two year, $16 million contract. This marks a significant shift away from their power run identity. Sean Murphy Bunting signed with the Cardinals on a three-year, $25.5 million deal, and Aziz Alshair moved to the Texans with a three-year, $34 million contract, weakening their secondary and linebacker depth. With just 54% of last year's starters returning, Tennessee's dramatic overhaul is a clear attempt to shake off the old and bring in a fresh wave of talent but it also raises questions about team chemistry and continuity. So, what's the strategy behind these moves? Drafting J.C. Latham in the first round to play left tackle and Tavondra Sweat in the second round for the defensive line shows a commitment to both protecting their quarterback and pressuring opposing QBs. The trade for Lajarius Sneed indicates a strategic push to bolster the secondary with a mix of youth and experience aiming for a more balanced and dynamic defensive unit. The acquisition of versatile players like Tony Pollard and drafting key linemen shows a clear shift towards a more adaptable offense, moving away from a one-dimensional, run-heavy scheme. Experts are buzzing about the Titans' aggressive offseason. Sporting News has rated the Titans' offseason moves with a B+, praising their ability to address multiple key areas and positioning themselves as one of the top-performing teams in the league this offseason. NFL.com noted that the Titans are building around Will Levis with a mix of solid veterans and young talent, which indicates a win-now approach rather than a slow rebuild. ESPN commended the Titans for their strategic approach, highlighting the team's efforts to shore up both the offensive and defensive lines as crucial steps toward long-term success. Now our bold prediction for the Titans 2024 season, they'll finish 9-8 and eight and just miss the playoffs. With such a high turnover rate and a mix of new faces, it might take more time for the Titans to gel. They've made significant upgrades, but with only 54% of last year's starters returning, there's still uncertainty about how quickly they can come together. Tony Pollard will be a key playmaker, and Will Levis must rise to the occasion to keep them competitive in a tough division. What do you think of the Titans' offseason overhaul? Will these moves push them back into contention? Or are they in for, for another year of rebuilding? Let us know in the comments, like this video, subscribe to Hitstick Football, and ring that bell for all the latest NFL news and insights. Thanks for watching, we appreciate you.